mucus is a thick, sticky substance that is produced in your respiratory tract. It serves a very important role because it helps protect your lungs from infection and foreign particles. However, when the body produces too much mucus, it can lead to a number of problems including difficulty breathing, coughing, and a runny nose. With that said, most people are unaware that the foods that you eat in your diet may actually be what's causing excess mucus to accumulate in the airways of your lungs. And one food in particular that we need to discuss is bread. And that is the topic of this video. So if you're ready, let's get into it. Bread is a staple in many diets, which is why you may be saddened to hear that it can cause an increase in mucus production. When you have a cold or suffer from allergies, you may notice that bread seems to make your symptoms worse. There are a few different reasons why this happens. First, bread is made with gluten, which is a protein that can irritate the lining of your intestines. This inflammation can cause the body to produce more mucus in an attempt to protect the intestines from further damage. Additionally, bread is often high in sugar, which can also contribute to mucus production. When the body senses sugar, it releases histamines, which are chemicals that trigger mucus production. Histamines are also responsible for causing other allergy symptoms like itchiness and swelling. Also, one study found that bread consumption was linked to chronic rhinosinusitis with nasal polyps which are growths inside of the nose. The study found that people who ate more than two slices of white bread per day had higher rates of these symptoms. Researchers also found a link between bread consumption and asthma. Their studies found that people who ate bread were more likely to experience asthma symptoms, such as wheezing, chest tightness, and shortness of breath. I know it's unfortunate because bread is very tasty, but if you find that it makes your symptoms worse, try avoiding it or choosing an alternative that is gluten-free. With that said, some other foods that can cause increased mucus include processed meat, sugar, dairy, fast food, soda, eggs, corn, and foods that are high in sodium. This is definitely something to consider when selecting foods that you eat in your diet on a regular basis, especially if you're suffering from signs and symptoms that involve excess mucus production. With that said, just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. But real quick, if you don't mind, do me a huge favor and hit the like button. It really helps support the channel and I greatly, greatly appreciate it. And you might as well go ahead and subscribe for more videos like this. Hopefully what you learned in this video was helpful and it goes to show just how important our diet is when it comes to preventing the accumulation of excess mucus and secretions. If you enjoyed the content, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you want to dive even deeper, we do have a full guide on our website. I will drop a link to it right below this video down in the description. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Have a blessed day and as always, breathe easy my friend.